It is now time for the prayer requests. Do you have something on your heart you wish to give Jesus? I know that I have the prayer requests, but there haven't been many right now because it's the new year, but there are heavy ones that we have been given. So um, at church, we got these cards, and then also I got texted to me many, and so I, I want to be able to go through these, okay? So number one, I'm going to read the ones from our, let's go ahead and do the ones online, and then, and then I'll do the cards. And uh, remember, you are very important to this. The only way is through you giving the prayer request. And by the way, Andy, I see you out there. Esther, Esther, you are very important. And I know you were going through dialysis on Sabbath, and I'm glad you went through it well. You're always in our prayers. And not only you, Esther, but there's another Esther that's with Ray and Mike. And we remember you in our prayers, as well as another Esther who's coming into membership very, very soon, this Sabbath. I need to talk to you, Esther. I can say your name because it's going to be public, Esther Medina. So um, uh, I know you've gone through your knee surgery, but uh, you were loved. And uh, we well, this Sabbath, we're going to be accepting you into membership as well as Cosette. So uh, look forward to that. Um, so we have Nestor, my, uh, my family member, Nestor. Uh, she prays for traveling mercies for Armand and Abby. Hey, that prayer has already been answered. They got to New York. They went through, they're going through their quarantine. And so I'm so glad, Abby and, Ar uh, and Armand, you were able to come to church and to, here in Southern California. It's wonderful to see you guys. You guys are amazing. And uh, I wish I could go visit you guys where you live. I used to live right near there, over there in Manhattan. So I wish I could be there, but may God bless you guys. And we love you. Also, Fritz, we're so happy. Fritz's healing has been happening. He's in good shape, and I'm so glad that he is. Um, Fritz, continue your healing. And Miriam, uh, continue taking care of your hubby, and, and we love you guys. And Sherry, I'm so glad to have you guys in our church. Even if I haven't seen you by face or only by uh, uh, video, I am so glad we're together. Um, also, uh, we want to remember... Um, Doug, his sister-in-law, Lisa, is here. And, and uh, then we also want to remember some very important people. Leonardo, Ortiz. I sent out on Facebook the rest in peace. Leonardo, after a long battle uh, in the hospital with COVID-19. Um, Le Leonardo was a great warrior. And Maria Cristina, we love you. You are in our prayers. And Ruth and the whole family. Um, Leonardo, we look forward to seeing him in the morning. For we have been promised that Jesus is coming again. He will raise everyone. He will raise everyone who has called themselves by Jesus' name. And you know what? Leonardo did call himself by the name of Jesus. He was here helping us in the Sabbath school on Zoom, disconnected from people. He, of course, did not get COVID-19 here on the campus. It was when he left and was gone to Pennsylvania, and I don't know, somewhere out there, he got COVID-19, but uh, we just, I wish I had been able to see him again. I was on the phone with him, but was not able to see him. And also Nanai, Nanai of Atiwelmi. Nanai also lost her life. We love you too. Mommy, um, we love her very much. Uh, and we love the whole family. She had 93 years, so we want to just remember them in our prayers, but we will see Nanai as well. Okay? These are hard ones. I'm sorry. Also, uh, Romeo brought up uh, also Antonio and Atilaida and Anthony. And we want to remember them in our prayers always. And Romeo, it's wonderful to see you this, the, the other Sabbath. And, and uh, it's, it's been a great thing. And we want to see more of you. I, I know uh, um, we're getting like uh, last Sabbath 85 people and everyone signs in. We're all very careful with this. And we make sure social distancing is happening and masks are worn. But... Um, it's so wonderful to see you. 
so wonderful to see every one of you who have come. Also, Ernesto is doing much better in his recovery. Continue, we ask uh, for continual prayers for him in his healing. Also, we've got Tom and, uh, and, and whose wife has passed away. We want to remember Tom in our prayers and also uh, Linda in Texas. Um, and, uh, and we always pray for Yvonne and also her caregiver, her children, but her caregiver, Lourdes, who's right now going through uh, uh, treatments for cancer, uh, pancreatic, or thyroid, sorry, thyroid cancer. I don't get them all right. Um, we also include in that list the um, uh, Amanda, who we always pray for, uh, for her pancreatic cancer. And I'm so glad for every day. Man, Amanda, you have survived through amazing times, but you've gotten to see family. And you've lived a good, long life. Continue, continue. For Jesus has a reason for you being here. Beatrice and Charles love you so much and your whole family. And Matthew, we just, just stay strong. Also, we have here the prayer request. Pray for um, Lupe. Yes, Lupe, who's taking the Discover Bible School. Lupe, I hope you will learn many good things from the Word of God. Jesus loves you so much, and I hope you learn that through Discover Bible School. If you want to take Discover Bible School, please text me at 626 497 7227, and we can continue with studies. You can start studies. I'm right now studying personally with a few people with masks and, and all that, but uh, we're going to have some baptisms soon. But, but uh, Discover Bible School is very important, and Ryan is going to be working on that as we start to send out Discover Bible School mailers to the community. So um, also we want to pray for safety for all the loved ones who are traveling, the parents, brothers, sisters, and grandparents. And I'd like to add to that the safety for all the police and all the firefighters and all, all the medical. They are going through incredible times right now with this COVID-19. It's crazy. So um, we love you guys as well, okay? So, uh, and our leadership and, and praying for elections and all that. But you know, I pray more for Jesus to be our leader. May Jesus lead and, 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 and may all this craziness in the House of Representatives and the Senate that's going on just kind of, may the right things happen, but may the will of God happen too. And may morality that's from the Bible actually reign through this. Also, there's a thank you, this is in Spanish, gracias, señor, uh, for health and for, uh, for mind and also for health of the family. Anita, we love you and we always uh, pray for you as well and your family. I know you're here on that campus and everyone in that parsonage there, uh, we pray for all the time. Also, um, it says, thank you, Pastor, your, for all your prayers for all of us. May God continue to to give a kindness and abundance to our church and uh, prayer for, for me as a pastor and prayer for our church and leadership, I agree. And I'm so happy to be able to have that prayer as a part of it. Um, and I pray, someone says, I pray that you help me change to become a better person, that you give me strength. And I pray that you bless my twins that are soon to come. Yes, to be strong and not stressed and healing. Uh, yes, to be strong and healthy. Yes, I don't know who this is, but I'm so happy. I pray every day for you out there, whether I know your name or not. Sometimes we're walking around with masks and all you see is the head and you see is the, the eyes like we're wearing burkas all the time. But each one of you have hopes and dreams and wishes and personalities. I ask for the ability every day to be a better person, to remember you, but also to be a good husband to my wife, Anna, to be a good father to my children, to be a good pastor. Harry, I'm listening to you, Harry, Harry Bay. Um, Yes, I pray every day and I hope you pray every day, Harry, 
for me as well. Let's bow ourselves together as we pray and we'll, um, I'll have a silent moment where you put your prayer requests and then we will end with the Lord's Prayer recited after me. Are you ready? Dear Jesus, we love you. I love you. We praise you. I praise you. We thank you and I thank you for being with us every day. Lord, be with those who have lost their family members in this time, in these hard times. Be with those who are cold and outside. Be with those who are battling with COVID-19, those who are battling with other Ill illnesses that are forgotten about during these times. Be with each one and be with the psychological condition of all of the people that are at home and locked away. Be with our old and our young. Be with everyone, Lord, that, and, and allow us to be able to love people even if they have different opinions and different directions and are on the other side of a war with us. Teach us, Lord, to love our enemies, to do good those, to those who treat us spitefully and abuse us. Teach us, Lord, not to be doormats, but to fight for what is true while loving those who disagree with us. It's a hard thing to walk, but teach us, Lord, to walk that daily. And now a moment of silence for each one of us. Please give your prayer requests now. Lord, you have heard our prayer requests. I thank you, Lord, for them. Our hearts are beckoning you. Our hearts are holding to you. And now, Lord, remember all of our churches, our denomination, our, our countries out there as we worship together you and help us to worship you no matter where we are, and find a way to connect with our churches around us so that we may have true shalom and peace that surpasses all understanding. Jesus, thank you. Be with our leadership. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us today our daily bread and forgive us our debts as we forgive those indebted to us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from the evil one. For thine is the kingdom, the power, and the glory forever, ever, and ever. Amen. In the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit, we say, Amen. May the Lord bless and keep all of you. May he make his face to shine upon you and be gracious to you. And give you shalom, the peace that passes all understanding. May love abide in you. God bless. Bye-bye.